Can you hear me now? Yeah. Does the audio and stuff sound okay? Oh, perfect. All right. It's a Friday night. I feel like being a chatty patty today. I'm gonna do my makeup because I got a lot of fun new makeup. Hi. <laughs> oh man, I have a crazy life update. So, where should we start? We should start with two weeks ago. Two weeks ago, I got back from Seattle, it was two or three weeks ago. I went to Seattle to go visit my family, my sister, her husband, and her two babies. And it was really, it was a really great time. I flew during Corona. That was an experience in itself. Um, yeah, that was an experience in itself. And also, I got addicted to this place called Dutch Bros over there in Seattle. And on my last day, we thought it would be fun to go to Dutch Bros. And I almost missed my flight home. When I tell y'all I was literally running through the airport, I felt like a, a scene in a movie. Like, is this really happening to me right now? It was honestly like a crazy, a kind of crazy, scary experience. I had to go to work the next day. I was like, oh my God, if I miss this flight, like what am I going to do? What? I've never in my life missed a flight before. I always get to the airport like crazy early. So that was like a first for me. That was really kind of, that was kind of scary. I don't think this foundation really matches me, but I don't care. I'm not going anywhere. I just feel like playing with makeup. I miss it. I don't do it anymore. I'm like working from home looking like... I'm live. <laughs> I'm always, I'm always just home all the time. So yeah, that was like two weeks ago. I almost missed my flight home. So that was fun. And then last week I had surgery, so I'm still recovering. I found out that I had some pretty massive cysts like in my ovaries. <sighs> I had to have surgery to remove those. <laughs> oh, this foundation doesn't match at all. So yeah, I had to have surgery. Um, it was a, a really crazy experience. They wanted me to have the surgery like two days before I flew to Seattle. I don't even know how that would have been possible because I have, I don't know, recovery has, has been hectic, hasn't been smooth. Um, but you know, day by day I'm getting better. And tomorrow's Halloween, I can't believe it. I want to put up my Christmas tree on Sunday. <laughs> I am so excited for my tree this year. I got... A new tree topper. You want a duck? Ma'am. I do not want any animals. Is it too soon to put up a Christmas tree? I'm so excited. I have like a Disney tree. And I just got all these new ornaments and a new tree topper. 
not doing anything for Halloween. So yeah. I'm gonna put this, everything that I'm using right now like doesn't match and I don't even care. This Rare Beauty foundation or this Rare Beauty concealer, I think it's like, um, I got the one that has like an olive undertone and like my, my foundation has like too much of a pink undertone. It's fine. What else is going on? I just seriously can't believe it's almost the end of the year. Like, it's been crazy. It's been a crazy year. Well, this concealer doesn't cover anything up either. Mm. Oh, I guess it's all right. What are you guys doing? It's Friday night. Y'all chilling at home? brighter concealer. I have. I'm so late to the game with these makeup palettes that I just got. So I haven't bought anything. So I, like I said, I haven't been doing my makeup or going anywhere. This, the mask covers it all. But, um, yeah. Shoot, I don't like this packaging. I'm gonna dump this. Let's see. Oh, I don't know what that says. I saw these funny, um, funny little hacks for people who still want to go trick or treating. It's funny. They have like these long poles that they're putting in front of their doors on their like doorsteps. And they're like these poles and they have like a, a wide hole. And it says like place back here and then trick or treat and then they slide the the candy through the hole. Just thought that was so creative. Um, ooh. I'm about to play with some new some new makeup. Let's see. Um, I just got this Dominique Cosmetics palette. The Latte 2. I have all of the palettes that she's come out with and all of her palettes are so pretty. This one was supposed to smell like coffee, I think she said. I don't really smell any coffee, but I got this one. And I'm so late to the game on this Blue Honey palette. It was on sale at Ulta for $15. I think usually they're like $38 or $42. So when I saw they were 15, I was like, oh, I've been wanting this palette. So I decided to get it and I don't know which one to play with. I don't think, it doesn't matter because I'm not going anywhere again for like the billionth time. I don't know which one I want to play with. I don't know. <laughs> decisions, decisions. I'll just play with, uh, they both actually kind of look really similar. <laughs> I don't know. I'll think about it. I'll finish the rest of my makeup. Well, and I also got this House Laboratories, the Lady Gaga makeup brand. I got her blush highlighter duo. 
This is in the shade Untamed and it's so pretty. It's like my vibe. It's my vibe. going on you guys so yeah that's what's going on with me and my crazy life oh my gosh and it's time to start like christmas shopping already what i love to shop for myself <laughs> I wonder how Black Friday is going to happen. Like, I wonder if people are still going to be like out and about fighting over TVs and whatever else they fight over. I'm more of an online shopper. So I will be waiting for Cyber Monday. Oh my God. I have not worn this bronzer in so long. Do y'all really go by the expiration date on your makeup? Q. Uh, my daughter watches a show called Q on Netflix. She loves it. I think it's about volleyball. And I think it's anime. I don't know. <sighs> There's like nothing coming out of this bronzer. Oh, I got a new earring for my conch. Look at that. So obsessed. I love that word, obsessed. space on here. I'm drinking a lot of Gatorade, supposedly electrolytes. Are supposed to help with like recovery. I don't know how or why. Um let's see. What else is coming on? Um, I'm trying to think of what else. Got my oh man, I left my blush brush. I think this this highlighter in here is way too pink, but I'm gonna play with the eyes now. Um, got my primer. Man, I freaking miss that comment. Welcome back. Where'd you go? There's a little bit of primer so it'll stick and grip. I really don't like this. Wow. Let's see. No. <laughs> Man, I had like a really um I, would, I really want to reorganize my closet. I don't know why. I 
feel like I just got rid of a bunch of clothes. But there's still like no, no space. I still have a ton of clothes. It's ridiculous. Um, this stuff is eye primer. I'm trying to hurry up. This stuff is sticky on the lids. Man, I really wish I had some Dutch Bros right now. That place is so good. I have no idea if it's like a West Coast thing or what. But if you have a Dutch Bros next to you or close to you, I'm jealous of you. I would go. I like the Tiger Blood soda. Oh my God, it's so good. Tiger Blood soda. I miss it. I want one so bad. We literally went like every day to go get a tiger's blood. I think my nephew was so over it. He was like, why do you always want to go get the blood? <laughs> so cute. He's only five. But that was so good. I love it. It was so good that I was scared to in Arizona, <laughs> Kentucky. I'm jealous. So good it was so good that I didn't even want to try anything else like I just wanted a tiger's blood so good want there are actually not any good shades in here I need like a brown Um, I'm trying to like get ready. Oh man, I really want to do my eyebrows. Your hands are cold. I'm so sorry. nice transition shade Cafe Con Leche Want And I really I think that there's um my friend told me about this there's like a Black Friday deal Black Friday sale for like um, airfare so if you want to travel I'm going to ask her what day that is it's like flights are like ridiculously cheap I think it's the I think it's the, the day of Thanksgiving or maybe it's like the day that Black, it, like the day that like Black Friday maybe or the Tuesday before Black Friday I don't know but I want to go back and visit my sister I went alone. This time I want to take my kids. Flying during COVID was a little scary. It was an experience for sure. You have to wear your mask the whole entire time you're on a flight. And then like going to see her was like a four hour flight. And I don't know why going to see her like I don't know. It was just, I felt like eternity, honestly. I lost concept of time in the air. I downloaded a boring show on my phone. I, on my iPad, I downloaded The Good Place. I don't know why I downloaded that. It's not a terrible show, but it didn't keep my attention for four hours. I was, I don't know, it was just, a long flight going to see her and wearing your mask the whole time but it wasn't bad 
I did have to get tested for COVID before my surgery. <sighs> oh my God, I think I got on that lady's nerves. I was so nervous to get tested because I just, I've seen people get tested. I've seen people get tested and she pulls out like a Q-tip like this freaking long and she's like are you ready and I was like no I'm not ready like you're gonna stick my brain and she's like yeah it is gonna feel like I'm going in your brain but I'm not going up that deep that's what she said and it and I was like well how where do you stop and it had like I don't know like the Q-tip is like this freaking long and then there's like a red line at the bottom and she's like I stop here and I'm like oh my god you're gonna it's probably not this big but I was huge and I was like procrastinating and I was like oh my god don't do it no pineapples I'm not ready I was like can you just lie and say you tested me without testing me <laughs> I don't even understand why I had to get like I don't know whatever I still had to wear my mask the whole entire time I was in the hospital even though I got tested so I don't know that they didn't do both nostrils they did my right and then finally I was like all right let's just do it I just stuck it back there and it's, it is it's not painful but it's uncomfortable it's my eye was watering I never want to get tested for COVID again <laughs> Oh man, I'm sure she was like over it. She's probably like this grown ass 30 something year old woman is in here. And she was like trying to tell me she had tested little kids. And I was like, you did? You tested little kids? And she's like, yes. And I was like, <sighs> and here I am freaking crying to get tested. And she did it really quick. It was a crazy experience. Hi. I don't even know what color I just dipped in. Love that for me. Hello, everyone. Um, but yeah, that was a crazy experience. I remember, um, so my surgery was last Thursday. And I remember waking up from my surgery <laughs> and then telling the lady that I was at Disney World. And she's like, were you? I was like, yeah, I was at Disney World. Disney World is like my favorite place. So. I'm the happiest place on earth tempting to go to but I see those crabs they're getting bigger and bigger by the week and I think they got rid of they got rid of fast passes I think and like I don't think you can do like the dining or something with them so I don't, I'm not gonna get the full Disney experience so and I'm kind of a chicken Oh, um, I we did see um, a good show. We caught a good show on Apple TV, The Morning Show. We're also late to the game with that show, but that show is really crazy good. It's with Steve Carell, Jennifer Aniston, and Reese Witherspoon. And it's so good. I can't wait for it to come back. And another one that's coming back that I'm excited for is You. I think that comes back sometime next year. And then Servant on Apple TV comes back like in January. That's a good show too. So I'm excited for these shows. I want to watch... 
defending Jacob on Apple TV. Netflix over here trying to raise their prices. Nice and full. <laughs> Man, I cooked today. I hadn't cooked in like over a week. It felt really nice to try to get back to normal. Um, made some enchiladas. And then when I, I go back and I see my doctor um, next week, so I'm going to ask her when I can go back to the gym. Because I, I decided that I want to go back. I'm so excited. I cannot wait. I can't wait. I can't wait to get the okay and go. I've missed my Orange Theory fam so much. And it's fine, like doing workouts at home. It's just not the same. It's not the same for me. But I tried it and I've been doing it and my gym has been open for a while. Um daughter's going back to school on Monday one of them trying to get back to normalcy now I miss getting my eyebrows done my eyebrows are so crazy wild this is a nice palette all of the shades are blending really nice I really like this palette. Dominique Cosmetics. She's always coming out with like some really cute stuff. I know she just came out with like a bunch of lipsticks and stuff and I'm like, I want to get some, but I don't, <laughs> uh, just the mask is going to mess it up. And I just got Shyla's lip combo or lip collab that she did with Dose of Colors. Those were limited edition. So I hear the word limited edition and I'm like moth to a flame. I'm like, I have to have it now. I want. I'm really trying to blend this out like I'm going somewhere. But. <laughs> it kind of hurts to sit like this. I don't know, I just feel like being a chatty patty today. Your eyebrows look like mountains. Wow. Wow, love that for me. I'm over here getting dissed by my cheering. No ducks for you. Um, I kind of want to do like a pop of color underneath my lash line, but I don't think I brought any eyeshadows, any eyeshadow, uh, <laughs> any eye, what am I trying to say? God, I feel like I'm on that stuff. I don't have any brushes for that. I left them all in the bathroom. But this is such a pretty palette. Look at that. Oh, it's coming off like way different on camera, but it's so pretty. I'm gonna try to put like a pop of color underneath because why not? Why not? Hey guys. What are y'all doing? Who's that? In sync? Ew. And we don't like in sync. We like the Backstreet Boys. Oh my god, speaking of the Backstreet Boys, I saw them 
uh, last year in September. Last September? Was it the Backstreet Boys came last September? And me, my sister, and my mom went to go see them. And then they were supposed to come back this September. So last month, I was supposed to have gone to go see them again. And COVID made sure that didn't happen. So now they're coming back in in um i think june <sighs> so covid has just been covid has just put a damper on everyone's day but my eyeshadow brushes are getting dusty and crusty Let's see how this applies. Probably should use my finger. You know, put too much. Hi. What you doing, girl? Ooh. It actually doesn't apply that one. Mm -hmm. Love that. Mm -hmm. My kids got me saying all these phrases. Love that for me. They keep me young. What's up, duck? They keep me young and they keep my hair is gray on my head. I think I needed to wet my brush, honestly. Just trying to use like my phone as my camera. But it doesn't really it's fine. It'll be fine. Now I'm going to try this new blush from Lady Gaga. I am excited. I left my blush brush in the bathroom. Can I use my bronzer? My bronzer brush? Oh my god, I literally love like all my brushes. <laughs> oh, love this for me. I have to wipe away my baggage and I don't have my brushes here. Last time I went live and did a little get ready with me, I brought too much stuff. Now I left everything in the bathroom. I love that for me. Are y'all dressing up for Halloween this year? Even if it's just to be at home? I saw Kim Kardashian was Carol Baskin and Joe Exotic. <laughs> I thought that was funny. And I think Kylie was a, a Power Ranger. All right. I got off all I could. Now I'm going to go in with this Untamed with a freaking bronzer brush. Because I don't have my blush brush. Oh, it's pretty pigmented. It's actually like more pigmented than my bronzer. My bronzer was, I think my bronzer is old. I'll have to throw it out. But this is really, really pretty. She has a lot of colors. Um, but all the colors that I really wanted were all sold out. I didn't know when they were launching or anything. I haven't really been keeping up with like 
makeup releases or anything. But I just saw, I saw them on Amazon and I was like, oh my God. So I did order a bronzer from her. I think that's supposed to be her Sunday. So I'm excited to try it. It's really pretty though. It's very subtle. I'm gonna try this highlighter, even though I really feel like it's way too peach or pink. But who cares? Oh my god, I remember day 26 and Danity Kane. <laughs> I used to be so obsessed. <laughs> I still listen to them. I got so many of these cruises. Hello. Hmm. All right. I'm going to put on some bottom liner. I was going to put a pop of color on the bottom lash line, but I'm going to do this mustard yellow and hopefully I don't regret it. The lights in front of me are so bright. Hard to tell that I'm putting any on. My neighbors are so loud. Oh my god. They'd be sending their kids outside. Come outside. Be in here with all that energy. Oh my god, we get an hour extra sleep this Sunday. I love that. It just sucks because it gets darker earlier. That sucks, but I love the extra hour of sleep. That doesn't even matter. So I'm probably going to wake up the time that I'm used to waking up anyway. I don't know what the purpose of daylight savings time is. If you know, let me know. I feel like they told me when I was in school and I don't know, I forgot. Right when I get used to the time change, it's gonna be time to change it back again. That can't be healthy. I really, really, really am so excited for this. This just came in the mail today. It's backwards. How pretty, and it came with some stickers. She's so pretty. I think these are just her stickers, and these are just a, yeah, these are just like dose of colors. And I guess she came out, I think those are, I think this is pretty, the soul happy, like her daughter. Love that. Packaging is so my aesthetic. A really pretty pink. Pink is nice. So you have the mousse liquid lipstick, the lip liner, and the high gloss. And I like that they're not like identical. She made the gloss a little lighter. So we love that. I gave myself an at home 
gel manicure. I'm like obsessed with this color. Oh my God, obsessed. I can't stop saying that. But I am. I used to, when I used to go get my nails done, I used to get this color like every fall and I miss it. Trying to get this out of here. It's stuck. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna start off with the lip liner. I always forget to line my lips, but I have small lips, so I wanna make them look larger. So I'm gonna go ahead and line. See how they look. I hate lining my lips, I'm so bad at it. It's probably why I never do it. And then I'm just gonna like I don't want it like super noticeable. I'm just gonna like blot it. This color looks so amazing on Shiva. Let's see how it looks on me. And this is velvet, so I like matte. I'm more of a matte girl, but I do like that. My lips are like way too crusty right now. Be using a matte anything. It's so soft. Thought it smelled like vanilla for a second. I do like it. I feel like it comes off a little bit darker on camera than it is in person. But I do like it. I like that it's not super drying. It's velvet. See how long it stays on though. And then I'm gonna try it on with her gloss. And these are all called, well, this is just her collab. They're all called Shyla. Oh, this smells good. It smells, it does it? I feel like it smelled like vanilla for a second. <laughs> I don't think it does. Love, love. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm gonna just flicker up my eyebrows right quick. I really, really just need to fix my eyebrows. <laughs> oh, I need to go get them waxed ASAP. I don't thread mine. I can't handle that pain. I went to get I went to get them threaded one day with my sister. I swear she was mad at me that day or something, cause she tricked me into threading them. She's like, "It's not that bad." What? Patootie is not that bad. That hurt. That hurt. But I'm about done. I'm gonna skip mascara and I'm gonna skip doing my eyebrows, cause I'm just gonna go shower and wash it all off right now but i was just in the mood to go live and do a little life update and you know let you guys know what's going on and what's been going on in my crazy world and yeah you guys thanks so much for tuning in to my live and and commenting and all that stuff so I'm going to go ahead and end it here, but just be on the lookout for more videos. Turn on your notifications so I have more videos on the way. And thanks so much for watching. No? Why? Did you just get on right now? Oh my God. I'm done. I'm about to get off. I'm about to call you. <laughs> I'll call you right now. But I'm about to end this live right now. Thanks so much for watching and playing along with uh, 
playing along with me or play, oh my god my sister's throwing me off here playing along playing along and watch me get ready and listen to my life updates and my crazy shenanigans stories so i'll see you guys in the near future